everyone welcome to the channel today we are going to learn about subtractors in this video like adders we have two kinds of subtractors half subtractors and full subtractors half subtractors is used to find the differences between the two single bit numbers now let's check out the block diagram for the half subtractor the block diagram of half subtractor consists of this square box it is hs is the half subtractors and x and y are the two input numbers whose uh, differences we have to find and b is the output of the differences between the x and y and b is the borrow borrow is like the carry of the adder now let's find the truth table of half subtractors x and y both are input and D is the differences and B is the borrow. So, half subtractor is used to find the differences between the two single bit number. So, 2 input means 2 to the power 2 equal to 4 number of the input combination. Okay. 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 0, 1. Now, when we find the differences, 0 minus 0, what will be 0? And here borrow will be 0. If 0 minus 1 so here we have to take one borrow then we will get the output of 1 okay so here the difference is 1 and the borrow is 1 1 minus 0 obviously 1 1 borrow no borrow so borrow is 0 1 minus 1 0 and borrow is zero so this will be the truth table for the half subtractors now we will find the boolean expression for the differences d and the borrow b for that what we have to do is find the one here for the differences here is one one and here is the another one for this one consider this and this one for the first one, what we have d for the dx bar because the value of x here is 0, x bar and the value of y is 1, so y. For the another one, here it is x and y bar. So this is the Boolean expressor for the differences. Now for the b, that is the borrow, we have 1 here at this position only. So let's check out for the x and y. So what is x bar? Here it is 0 and y is 1. 1. So this is the Boolean expression for the differences and the borrow of the half subtractors. Now by the help of this Boolean expression, we will make the circuit for the half subtractors with using the logic gates. So the Boolean expression for the differences and the borrow are these two. And this stands for x, x or y. This is the expression for the x, x or y. So now using the logic gate, first we will draw for the d. So d is what? Nothing but the xor gate between the input x and y. So here we will get d. Now what is the borrow? Borrow is the x complement. No intersection. So x complement so here we will write not get here this is the x complement and y y here and what we get is b right d is the differences and b is borrow so this is the circuit diagram for half subtractor using logic gates. Hope the concept is clear. If you have liked the video, please share this with your friends and subscribe to my channel.